on that same side leg, pushing off of Jeff's leg and driving off my own, resetting all the way down the mat. You ready to try it? To the hip. So I'm trying to touch this elbow and this knee together through his body. I'm just crunching him in towards me as tight as I can. In order to try and take out that frame that he's using, this leg closest to the head is just gonna sprawl out and I'm just gonna try and touch my hip down to the floor, staying as heavy as I can. Powerful elbows back, so he's doing good. Can anyone tell me the reason why he has the hand underneath my arm? If I reach for his weapon, what can he do? Chicken wing. Uh, exactly, he can chicken wing my arm. If, his, if he fell into this position in the wrong way, right? And his hands were like this, but his hands, his weapon's on the right side, and I reach for his weapon, what do you think he'll do? What is it, lean? Absolutely, he's just gonna roll over and trap that weapon to the ground. All right, just a couple things to think about when you're in this position. Good, Good. we'll do this again, don't worry. So from here, I'm going to thread the needle, keep control of that arm, and end up in his guard. Okay, we'll run through it again. Oh. Now, see, so now you went too far back. He can just roll right on top into your feet. Yeah, right yeah. here. And then, so, yeah, go ahead, reset. Reset. Yep, bridge my hips. Rotating towards that weapon side. Delivering that kick. Going to the knee. Pushing off with that framing arm, getting into a good stance. Way up. I don't want to see anyone trying to do this number where they try and like sit up and post with their guard so locked. It's going to be pretty difficult. So as soon as you sit up, open that guard, shoot your butt back, posting up on that arm, framing with the opposite. You want to bridge up, rotate towards that weapon side, deliver that kick, immediately go to a knee, push off, and step away. We good? <laughs> sit up, shoot back, and as soon as I'm coming up to here, I'm throwing my hips up through. So I come up, hips through, all the way off to the side. This one's pretty simple, I promise. We good to try it or we need to see it again? If I crash down too high on his arm, he's too strong up here, and if I go too low, he can lift that arm up and deliver an elbow strike to my face, and I'm going night-night, all right? So gable grip, right on that joint, bring that arm center line with your body. We good so far? I took one leg of the table so far. Get them to post those arms. Get outside the arm, one arm in, one arm out. Crash down on that joint. I got one leg of the table. Take your foot, same side, pin that foot of theirs to your butt. Then we're looking at a 45, bridging, and rolling that individual to the side of the legs that we collected. Yeah. Yeah.